Hello everyone, I'm Carlos Justiniano, and in this screencast I will introduce you to Node.js. Node.js is an application which allows developers to write server-side code using JavaScript. Node itself is written in C++ and uses Google's V8 engine to execute JavaScript. V8 is also the JavaScript engine that's built into Google Chrome. You can think of Node as a wrapper around V8, which is designed to simplify the building of custom server applications. This approach isn't new. Node is similar to Ruby Event Machine and Python Twisted, but designed for use with JavaScript. So why would you want to use Node? Well, if you're a developer who spends a significant portion of your time writing client-side JavaScript, the idea of being able to quickly build server-side code in JavaScript may be both convenient and actually appealing. One benefit is that code can be shared on both the client and server side when appropriate. Another benefit is that communication between application tiers can use JSON. Let's actually install Node.js from scratch on a fresh Ubuntu box. For this screencast, I'm using a Rax-based cloud server instance, but if you don't have a spare Ubuntu box or a local VM, I highly recommend this option if you're interested in trying Node.js. The first thing we're going to do after launching a fresh server instance is to install the latest security patches. App get update. Because Node.js is available on GitHub, we'll need to install the Git version control system. This will allow us to grab a copy of the Node.js source code. App get install git core. Next, we'll install the build essential package. This will load tools such as libraries, interpreters, and compilers, which are essential to building other applications, namely Node.js at this point. App get install build essential. Node.js supports SSL, so let's install that too. App get install open SSL. App get install libssl dev. Now that our machine is properly set up, we'll clone a copy of Node.js from the GitHub repository. Git clone git github.com joint node.git cd into the node directory we're looking at the node.js project source code let's build node.js in the standard unixy way using the configure make and make install phases configure make the make phase takes a while because it's also building the v8 javascript engine Make install. Now that node is installed, we can proceed to build a simple server. nano simple server.js. Note the JS extension. In this example, we begin by first loading a required module called HTTP. In this case, the HTTP module allows us to create a web server which simply returns a response hello world when queried via an HTTP GET request. Note that the web server is being instructed to listen to port 8124 at 204. .232.212.213. Let's test this by asking Node to run our simple server. Node simple server.js. If we open a web browser and type the following, we'll see the response from Node. Now, this is a simple example, but imagine building a more complex JavaScript application. Well, that's all the time we have. To learn more about Node, visit Node.js.org.